Hey, it's Antti. I'm still on my summer vacation, but I'm at the moment on my summer cottage and I thought I will do a one quick movie poster replication. And this time it is this miseducation of Cameron Post. So let's check it out. So as I said, I'm on my summer vacation. Um, I will show you what kind of views I have. I've just turned around this laptop. I'm recording everything. I'm just going to turn around. So behind me, there is a lake. Uh, 27 degrees at the moment and sauna is behind here. So let's go into Photoshop and see how this image was done. So do let's do some analyzing what we need to do. Okay, here we are in Photoshop. So I have loaded the poster image here. So let's do some analyzing. I think it's a, in a way, natural light shot of uh, this woman here. You can see from the eyes, uh, basically, uh, and all the light, it seems. Definitely for me, it's a natural light shot. Um, and then there's um, this kind of a hue uh, from orange, greens and yellows kind of a palette over it. But then also here's some kind of a really colorful noise. It's not monochromatic noise, but it's a color, color noise in the picture. So let's try to replicate this one. Um, I have selected just one picture from uh, Unsplash. So let's put this over here. Um, I think I'm gonna scale it just to fit in kind of the same way. I'm gonna make it slightly smaller. So we will have a bit of a same kind of a... Something like there. I mean, you can do any kind of a variation of this but I'm just going to get the same kind of a cropping in a way of that image so here's our image what we need to do is start to get this kind of a color grading um, and definitely the easiest one to replicate this specific look is to make a copy out of of that image if we have and then we're just gonna blur Gaussian blur and Let's go overboard, really. So you will get that color palette only um, for our of our image. Uh, then I think we would need to go with the hard light. So basically, the color palette you can kind of uh, modify it also slightly if you want, scale it up and down, or just to see how we want that those colors to be I think I will scale it slightly so I'll get the highlight in the, the eye area over there so now if we look we are already quite closer so from from that to here so yeah they look in a way the same what else as I said in this picture there's the, there was this colored noise in a way so let's replicate that look so we're gonna make a blank layer on top of it and paint it with neutral gray shift backspace gives us a file fill dialog and we choose from here 50% gray press ok and then we go filter noise and add noise and we don't want that monochromatic a noise we want that colored noise in there I'll just drop down the amount slightly something along it needs to be heavy but maybe something like 70% press OK and we put that on a blending mode overlay I think that's a bit too much actually but we can always drop the opacity down. So even further down, something along like that. So now we have that kind of a colored noise in the picture. So let's do a bit more analyzing again. And one thing I, I can see definitely from the image that there's a, in the deepest shadows on this side, 
there's some kind of a purplish bluish tones so let's add that also in so I wouldn't want that shade to be somewhere around here so I'm going to um, make an adjustment layer on top of this one selective color and we choose the blacks and then we concentrate on that area and we will definitely need some washing out so I'm gonna drop the the blacks slightly down uh, adding a bit more blue there and maybe hint of cyan trying to get that kind of a bluish tones into the shadows slightly so if we look this image and this image I think they are in the same area same palette in a way and you can modify and tweak how you want this background image or where you want want it to be I think that's even slightly better over there so there you have really quickly how you can turn your images if it's a studio shot or natural light image into that kind of a movie poster so from this I replicated this so Hopefully you like this quick tutorial, put a thumbs up if you like, especially subscribe and comment and give me suggestions what kind of posters or images or uh, retouching techniques I would, I, would try, I would try to replicate on my next videos. I have plenty of ideas, but I think this is a uh, becoming cool way of researching Photoshop and trying to imitate certain kind of a looks. So, Antti is out, I'll still on my vacation uh, end of this week and I will be seeing you on my next videos. Cheers!